Uh, problem number seven of section 2.3 gives us a, a function which is a sum of two compositions of functions here. So we're going to need to use the chain rule to compute its derivative. So first step, g prime of p. Uh, first step is we use linearity to compute the derivative of each term here. So let's start with the first. Now we see that we have uh, function 3p squared plus 2p sort of inside the function which raises variable to the ninth power. So we first treat this as just kind of a single variable and multiply this by 9 and repeat what we have here. So this is just kind of applying the power rule to um, this considering this just as a single variable. So uh, and that should be 3 times 2p or 6p plus 2 or excuse me no. We need to repeat the inside, so we have 3p squared plus 2p. Now we lower the power by 1, 8, and now we need to multiply by the derivative of the inside. So now we can take the derivative of the inside, which is 6p plus 2. And for the second term, uh, we'll do a similar thing. So we have 11 bring down the power, and repeat what we have on the inside. So 4p cubed plus 72, and then lower the power by 1. So we have a raised to the 10th power, and then multiply this by the derivative of the inside, or 12p squared, and the derivative of 72 is just 0.